Hello everyone. Today I am going to sh- explain you about this monster calculator which I made. Well, it's not yet ready, but I just wanted to explain you about it because I had uh, made one recording, but then somehow it went away. But never mind. So, see, this is the screen which I had made without telling you, so I'll explain that today. So, one event I had taken, and then I had set the ID as button 1, right here. Of course, you get the ID by placing your mouse right there. So like that, I get the idea of everything. If you can see it right there, near my pointer, right over here. And then, over here, then I get all to set the text inside this. And I had told it to get the number for setting the text from text input one that is this see the id comes id is like the name so then get number and see you can see the small plus over here or see over here so then i had to want to get another number from text input two that is over here and add them see i got that add option from here in the math so you can see this add ah, subtract so i just taken this and i'd inserted get number from ui controls or here there like get text don't put get text because then it will uh, not work the way it will just put the number side by side so somewhere around here it was there so anyway so then on event button 2 see like this button is for going to the subtractions so button 2 if I click it that is over here click but I put something else also click or mouse down mouse up something like that so then it will set the screen to screen number 2 it will get the screen Number two, see, I'll show you. Next subtraction, I clicked it and see it went to screen number two. So then for screen two, on event button three, now this is button three, I'll show you. Wait. Wait. Okay. So then, I am going to screen 2 to show you this. So I put the, the pointer here. And this is on event button 3. So this is, that was button 3. Okay. See, this is button 3. Over here, calculate. is button 3. Set text from label 10. So I put many labels. So yeah, this is label number 10. Where's label 10? Yeah, this is label 10. This big box. So then I told to get the number. See, get the number only. If you tell get text, it will totally go haywire. Like it won't go so bad. It won't work properly. It won't give the correct answer. Like in addition, I tried it get text. It just put the number side to side. I don't know why, but uh, look that. So then, and you can see this minus over here also. So text input. So this is a text input box as you see here. See, I'll show you. This is a label. So all these which we don't have to type anything are called labels. And this text input is the input box where we can type. So 
then and i don't know what all these other buttons are for because i've not been taught in my white hat junior classes so then over here i have made all these so then i have once i click on something i will get all the details so i have set all this and i have typed all this okay and for this also i have typed all this and all so then in code i have told it so it's like very less code for doing so much like some jolly jolly hard calculations or something you can just do it here and don't worry i'll be showing how to make the multiplication and division also when i make it and see i had renamed this to master calculator otherwise it would be like untitled project then i saved it and then you can just click on the link over here just click on it and it will copy like you have to click on it and then you have to copy it and so then just look that okay then see you next time everyone and i'll show i'll definitely show you how to do the multiplication and division uh afterwards so bye for now